just finished part four of the tutorial. Now we're going to play our games. I am back up to rank 10. Control Warrior was doing it. I think people have been discombobulated by the, the Undertaker nerf, which I don't really mind. Makes me wonder if I should not just continue with the Control Warrior. Uh, I'm going to play one or possibly two with the mage and see what happens. If I get a bunch of paladins or zoos, zoo, 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 zoo I'll go back to the warrior. Most people do not get what they read. So it's a hunter, Geraldo. Actually, it looks like Haraldo. Um, ugh. Two of those and no secrets. That's not exactly a recipe for success at the moment. I like the golden one though. Look at her move. The swirly arcane symbols in the background. Swirly. Okie doke. What do we got? Flame cannon. I'm less stressed about making sure I use that if he plays an Undertaker. Okay, we're actually doing pretty good. So I'm going to do that. And I'm going to do that. Yeah. It's not a lot of board control, but it's something. Now I just need a secret. Preferably a good secret. He doesn't have animal companion right now. I would certainly not say no. Hmm. Now here is the thing. I could play mirror entity naked, hit that with my blast, and keep the three one. I'm going to play the Kirin Tour Mage, get that for free, but then I can't clear the Undertaker. I don't think that's the best move. I mean, I've got these, but I think this is actually better. He already played his coin to get the Harvest Golem out. Piloted Shredder. That's amazing because that thing trades so well with the Piloted Shredder. Flame Strike. Alright, let's see what he gets out of it. <laughs> okay. I'll take that. I think we're doing pretty good here. It was a timely mirror entity. I'm glad I played that. 
All right. I can Frostbolt, Hero Power, and then clear that. Yeah. That's two, two, and two. Put you out, Frostbolt, Hero Power. Okay, we're doing pretty good. Got a fireball as backup. We've got the flame strike, though I don't know that it's going to come in handy because he is just not able to put anything else out. Put this apple on your head. It's probably going to. Oh, here's a beast. Oh, you got kind of lucky there. That's all right because these things trade so well. I should have killed that first. Damn it! Should have played that first. Well, what can you do? We have many secrets. I should have done that exactly the opposite order that I did it. Because if I played the mage and then put my counterspell up first, then when the Undertaker, when the mad scientist died, he would have pulled up a different secret. Is that what you thought was going to happen? I'm guessing not. Yeah. You misplayed the whole thing. I mean, I made a mistake. It wasn't a severe one, but it was a mistake. But you were just playing terribly. I mean, what the hell was with that feigned death? I'm going to play feigned death on a single... I mean, I guess you probably thought you were going to get Thaddeus out of it, but that's not what his death rattle does. Okay. I don't think we need two of those. I'm going to keep that though because it's a hunter. Alright. So, yes. Hogwarts Gnome. Hello. Do I he do I coin the hero power? No, I think I coin out the mad scientist actually. If he trades, I get a secret, and then the next turn I can still play Sorcerer's Apprentice without worrying about being killed by that scumbag no. Yes. Interesting. Got the counter spell, which means if he's got animal companion, he can't play it. Please try it though. That would just make my day. Okay. It's gonna try and buff it.
Is it Snake Trap? Snake Trap could stink for me. Hey, get it's not Snake Trap. Do I try and go for the... No, I think I'm going to do that. King Crush. Okay. I mean, he's going to trade this into that. not what I wanted to happen. But, what can you do? Oof. That's a pity. I feel for you, hombre. trap for you. So that's definitely explosive. I know that. Again. Freaking awesome. Well, I got King Crush the first time. I can't really complain.
16. I don't know if there's anything I can do. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, seventeen. Nope, I'm screwed. That's annoying. That's the annoying thing about the stupid hunter hero power. I was kicking his ass. I needed one more turn to beat him with that stupid hero power. Plus he had both of his kill commands in his hand. That's pretty lucky. Damn it, I want to get another beer. Cilantro, cilantro, es mi corazón. El gato, el gato, el gato no es bueno. I need something I can play. I got cash ball back. Job done. <sighs> Jesus. Hello? Can't have that. What a surprise. I think I want to pop that shield because otherwise he's just going to. There's something wrong with my mouse. I don't like that. I think Chelsea broke my damn trackball. I did not let go of that trigger.
Could just poly that. That would cost him four mana. Yeah, but he can't poly because I have that. Nice. Hello, <laughs> freaking awesome. Hello. Yeah, what's up? What? Yeah. What about it? say yeah I don't know I'd have to see it that's not what I want you to do nothing forget it. all right bye <sighs> Cheese and crackers. Why would you frost ball that? You can't attack that yet. No, he's got to kill Rag with the with his Azure Drake. No, no not.
Out of it yet. Like that. Definitely like that. Well, that's just stupid, stupid, stupid luck. Let's see what he got. I got Rag out of my... What you call it? I got Malorn out of my... Unstable Portal. That was obnoxiously good luck. Wait, do I have lethal? Nine. Yeah, I do. Well well I'm not even sure I deserve that win, to be honest. They got really incredibly good luck out of those random jobs. Alright, I'm going to... Get another beer. Day is it? Eight o'clock. Garbage, garbage, garbage. All right, give me that dust. I need it, precious. All right, I'm gonna get a beer. I'll be back in a second. Temp fate and play a couple more games. Because As I said on Moulin Rouge, everything's going so well.
Kane versus Rexa. Let's go on. Begin. You asked for it. <sighs> Hunter, eh? That's not good. All right, awesome fat. What's going on here? Ah, oh, I didn't get a win for that. Ooh, I picked my cards. He's the one that timed out. Screw that guy. Awesome fat. Hardly awesome. Awesomely hard. And she loves you, but not in a queer way. Not in a queer way. A warrior. Let's see. Control warriors need to be handled with the utmost of delicacy. Now what? We got beeps and buzzes going on all around me. Oh, the friggin' tutorial just finally uploaded. Alright, I need for that thing to not trigger a mirror entity when he kills it with his axe. Not safe for Kaiba? Oh, a Yu Gi Oh reference. That's adorable. Hey look, he played the Fiery War Axe. As constant as the Northern Star. Thank you, sir. A Grimscale Oracle? Ugh. Just terrible. I need to trigger that just in case he has a way of killing it and I don't get any value out of it. Two mana left. There's another fiery war axe, he can use it. I'm not object to fireballing or frostbolting that thing if I got it. What are you gonna do with two mana? Is he gonna. Cruel Taskmaster? What now? 
Yeah, it sure is. Interesting. I think I just do that. I was going to get that last card out of it anyway. I would hope he doesn't have Death Bite. It's probable. It would be better for me if he didn't. That was a mistake. Why would you have done that? You would, uh... I'm sorry. He had to use the coin in order to shield slam to kill them. I would call that good value. Alright, so what do we do? I can play Mana Worm. See one. That's four. Yeah, let's do this. Mana worm. Counter spell. I don't want him to play his other. Okay. I think I'm going to Do that. Gives me an overload next turn, but I don't want to, uh, but he can't. Yes, he can. So I'm going to mirror entity. I do not want a duplicate of that garbage murloc. That is faux show. That would well and truly suck. Uh, maybe he'll make a really egregious error and play... I don't know, Dr. Boom. Dr. Boom! Do it. Do it. Do it. Come on, do it. Dr. Boom! Yeah, I'll take that. I 
I bring light to the One thing I will say is that stupid Gorehow gives him a lot of minion killing value. And once again, Alex Drossa hits me for 15 damage. That's two, that'll make that eight. Oh, that's awesome. Got rid of both of his shield blocks. That's just a dream come true. Land strike. Dirty Miner? Who the flip is Dirty Miner? I don't take anonymous invites, thank you. Rom, he's gonna roll in. Ugh. Not really. 15 damage! I'd love to know how many times Alex Dross is used on Warriors' own health instead of their opponents. I will fight with honor. You asked for it. Loxy McFly. McFly! Fujitsu son! Oh, look, a paladin plays. Uh, what do you call it? Zombie chow. That's another one for the record books. The 
Божий Сатирки. You can play the next turn, that's pretty nice. Muster would be unfortunate right now. I would not like to see that. There it is. Alrighty. He can play quartermaster next turn. Can I prevent that? No. What to do? What to do? So what do I do? I have to try and mitigate the damage. Most fascinating. I would love for him to run both his shredder and the sword into my life. Like that. that would be awesome. In fact, I wouldn't even mind if he's concentrated here. That would be pretty much all of his mana. A six mana humility. Huh. Oh well. We are just feeling a little Rococo, aren't we? So what do I do? Do I counterspell? I think so. That's three. No, I'm gonna counter. Let me save counterspell. As your break. He's probably going to save his muster for. I mean, obviously, he wouldn't do it before he hit the with the four one. I'm going to save his muster for him right now. Okay. He's going to save for turn eight when he can combo with the. What do you call it? Maybe I'll get lucky and he won't hit Lofa. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Suck it. Mm. Oh, come on, flame strike. Damn it. But he does not have any room. Well, he's got room for one more. 
Still in kind of a shitty spot. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Maybe we put this out. Put a secret up. Quartermaster still kind of stinks for us. And that is not the entity I wanted to get from the mirror. I mean, Jesus. Oh, I just need flame strike. That's all I need. Flame strike to win it. Flame strike to win it. Give me flame strike. Come on, baby. That is not flame strike. God damn it. All right. Five, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We are getting super close to bad news bears. I think I have to do this. We have many secrets. How come Coma can just summon a card when he asks for it? Oh dear great wow gods. Please summon me, Blame Strike. Now I gotta wait for him to go through and kill me with four things. He didn't get quartermaster this whole game, but ugh. that does not help. Not at all. I mean, I'm going to lose, so I might as well play it. Three, four, five, six. Uh, there's nothing we can really do. Two fireballs. <sighs> well, that was good, but nah, I'm not gonna fight it out. Well played. Right. Let's play. I'm gonna control boy. See how that does. Man, I'm really starting to loathe mustard. Don't even need the quartermaster for it to be any other thing. With quartermaster, it's just downright imbalanced. It's not great. I need a fiery war axe. Not one of those things, if you haven't noticed, is a fiery war axe. Hmm. The Warlord of Draenor back. You nerd. Only nerds play Warcraft. Nerd. Nerd.
Hmm. Why do you have a golden portrait and you're still at rank 9? Do some real work. That may not have been the best move. I probably should have played the Acolyte. But, I wanted him to regret spending the first two moves just building armor. Wasted that whirlwind. He's going to get. I should. I mean, I could execute him so he only gets as many cards out of his as I got out of mine. But I think I need that execute for later. Waste a whirlwind on. Got no other value out of it, so I'm all right. Nine cards. I've got seven plus the axe, so I'm one behind. Neither one of us have board presence. So I've got a lot more health. I'm going to black knight that. Now, what do I do? Neither one of us has anything. He can't kill Geddon with an execute. I could play it, remove his armor, and he could take seven to the face and then armor up shield slam it. That would actually be pretty good. The alternative is playing Dr. Boom and hoping he doesn't have a big game hunter. But what now? Hmm. What the hell? I'm feeling saucy. Let's see what he does. If he had to go seven to the face in order to kill it, I would not be sorry about that. Wow, okay. 
Wait, what did he do? Shield slam and execute? Okay. Interesting. He lost a charge on his weapon in order to put Despite up, in order to hit me four to the face. I don't really understand why he did that. If he was just going to shield slam and then execute Baron Giddon anyway. Might have been a mistake. I mean, he can hit the one four. No, oh, well, he's gonna kill that. That's all right. I can take the hit. What do I do? I play Sylvanas. Six, eight, and then execute that. I can just, no, I can just shield slam that right out. Shield slam that. And then play Dr. Boom. Or do I play this and then taskmaster that to kill that? Use both as death blight. I can't remember. Gnomish inventor. What a strange, strange card. <laughs> Let's see if he's got Big Game Hunter. Fiery War Axe. Hitting the one is risky. That could take you four to the face in addition. It's going to cleave. Nice. Execute. Alright, that's both of his executes. And some of us still have them intact. I want him to be forced to hit the 1-1 one -one with his axe. And I want him to get a free shield slam on Sylvanas. Oh. 
Yes! Suck it! Ah! Like water over a stone, baby. Wore you down. Alright, that's it. I'm done for the night. I uh, will see you in the morning.